system in order to make the councils work effectively. We shall focus on the grassroots, the ordinary people and the local communities. We shall reverse the current situation where the country and the states are rich but our people are poor. Where the government and oil companies are rich but their host communities are poor. We shall make every rivers man, woman, and all other residents of river states the focus of all policies, strategies, and action, and never forget to care, especially for those who live in the shadows of life. If we engage ourselves more appropriately, every day shall be like Christmas for our brothers and sisters there. If you neglect them, if you neglect them, you neglect God. The conspiracy, the conspiracy to stop Dumolulu breaks is strong. But my passion for River State is total. And in that accord, I swear eternal fidelity to the just causes and pursuits of happiness of every rivers man, woman, and child. And of course, and of course, in that pursuit, I am conscious that I have God's blessings. We shall translate to votes on March 2nd, 2019. It is true that the electorate have had minimal say on who leads them, but it is up to us in 2019 to allow the existing order or to change it. I declare that there is no greater power that will decide who becomes governor of River State or occupies any elective office in 2019 than the people of River State under the guidance of God. I know that the path to freedom is not always easy and fighting against an entrenched political system is never simple. But we can do it. We can do it with our collective willpower. The tax at hand may appear Herculean, but it is achievable. We have enough strength and abilities in our hearts and in our PVC. You be a fine boy, you no get PVC. Busa, you fine, no. You be a fine girl, you no get PVC. Busa, you fine. If you a fine boy, you no get PVC. Busa, you fine, no. You be a fine girl, you no get PVC. Busa, busa. Politics and electioneering are very expensive business, and so every rivers, and so rivers people, and indeed Nigerians, are encouraged to take ownership of this liberation movement. Your support is vital in safeguarding our future. Support the rivers liberation movement 2019 agenda with as little as a hundred naira. It is yours. 2019 shouldn't just be a transition from one governor to another or from one party to another. 
It should be a turning point in our history, a defining moment that alters the future of River State from the current disorder, pain and tears, to an era of prosperity that leaves no rivers person or resident behind. I have the vision and I have the passion to bring about the river states of abundant and equal opportunities for all. I therefore offer myself for election as the governor of River State in 2019 on the platform of the I have no Godfather, but God the Father. I desire to take us from this era of policy implementation deficiency to the place of healthy and vibrant institutional governance, where no man, no matter how connected, can be bigger than any state institution. So for those who have been praying for real change in River State, this is your opportunity. We shall, by the grace of God, do it together. It is not about Dumolulu bricks, but about all of us, about our present and our future well-being as a people. I call on all River's people to stand up and make their PVCs count. Let us put an end to the era of government that maltreats its own people. Let us mold a prosperous future for River State together. The torch, the torch has to pass. To a new generation of River's people whose common enemies are hunger, disease, illiteracy, and tyranny. Let the year 2019 be a turning point. Therefore, remember this. Therefore, let one reach one. Let one bring one. And let one tell one. And together, we shall liberate River States. All I have been trying to say, yes, all I have been trying to say is thank you. God bless you. God bless River Sticks. Thank you. Since their mama born them, they never saw me. Since their papa born them, they never saw me. Since their mama born them, they never saw me. Oh, do more. Show them the way. Show them, show them. Show them the way. Show them, show them. Show them the way. Show them, show them. So let me wait. Thank you. Please sit down, Your Excellencies. As a man speaks, so he is. That's what the Bible says. Is that not true? It is a long time I had a speech like this. And may our son, Chief Dumo Lulubriks, be as he has spoken. And even God, the Father of all of us, created the world, the whole world, with his spoken word. And the Bible also told us that we are created in the likeness of God, the Father. Amen? God, the Son. Amen? And God, the Holy Spirit. And so I believe him that in the days and years to come, River State will approximate California or Texas in the United States of America.
Let me invite his running mate, our own brother, Chief, and His Excellency, Otua Hart Nakwasa, to come and say thank you to all of us, both of us, from our Deputy Governor to be Your Excellency, Otua Hart Nakwasa. Thank you. to draw the curtain at this time. It has been the World Press Conference by the River State Accord Governorship Candidates, uh, Dominic Brooks, held, that uh, held here today in Port Harcourt, uh, River State. Thank you for staying with uh, Channels Television. It's now time for us to hand over to our studios for regular programming. I am Emmanuel Iri. On behalf of the crew, see you next time. All the shit.